And we're back to you guys for more Zelda Diminished Cap. Now we've entered the temple in the sky. And hopefully we'll be done with this very quickly. Not on this part, at least I doubt it. Each temple takes at least like 40 minutes to clear, especially if I want to like find uh, the piece of pieces or pieces of heart. I'm not really sure how many there are here. But if I find it, uh, I mean, I do, I do remember getting one from here, but I really can't recall how I got the other one. So, um, not entirely sure what's gonna happen. We'll see. So you can use boomerang, arrows, bombs if you like for pressing the switches. We got like a puzzle here. Okay. So what am I supposed to do here? Ah, oh, push that rock. Stone, whatever. Here we go. Yeah, this place is not really that difficult. Um, it's just that there's like a lot to do, and the boss battle is really fun. Oh boy, <laughs> yeah, those are like bomb creatures that float. Now here we can't stand on that ground for too long, or else it's gonna break. are more of those bombs. The bomb ob the bomb omb <laughs> Bob om bomb bob <laughs> So we got a bunch of Mario cameos. There's a fluffy cloud here. It looks so co awfully comfortable. Yeah, it's really nice how in fantasy worlds the clouds are often um, portrayed as, you know, really comfortable pillows, because they kind of look like pillows anyway. Like, it would be really nice if it, w if it was like that in real life. I mean, imagine if, uh, for example, um, you fall off from the sky, you know? Like you're like an airplane is crashing and all of a sudden it lands on a cloud and it, and then it just floats around till someone comes to the rescue. I mean that would be very useful. <laughs> Here's some wizards. They're very similar to the old school Zelda games. Um, I mean there have been wizards in, for example, the Wind Waker. But, you know, appearing like this and, and shooting a little ray, it's very similar to the... to the Zelda um, A Link to the Past uh, boss. It's good to stump them, because otherwise they're just going to be popping out really quickly. So let's see what we got. We got a cape! Rock's cape. Jump with the greatest of ease. Hold the button to jump farther. Cool. There we go. So in a 2D game, we're jumping. Pretty cool. So before we continue, there's something you can get here. First you burn your butt like this, run around, and then <laughs> you like you just do that. Keenstone piece. And jump back up. Really easy. So with this we'll be able to reach places we haven't reached before. 
You can also get a new move from from the Swordmaster. These blue chews are everywhere. Let's take a... I think you can go down there. So let's make this jump. Huh. The bombs are in the way to interrupt you. Wait a second. Use this. What the hell? I guess they're higher than I can actually hit them. I have to jump even if they're in the way. Ooh. Okay. What's next? This doesn't seem that difficult. Um, I think it's like this. You gotta hit them with the swords. There we go. Whoa. Ah, oh, I think it this these guys die with bombs. Ow. <laughs> One of them fell. Man, these bombs are slow. Oh, whatever. <laughs> yeah, I guess that was the way that you should do it. Just let them fall. Like, stand right in the corner and they'll fall. There's a strong gale blowing here. Try not to get swept away. Sure, buddy. Sure, buddy. Whoop. Oh, I guess I guess his advice was very necessary. <laughs> so we hide in these holes till we're able to move forward. You could try and resist the wind a little bit and uh, and hold on, but you know, and try and uh, move forward, but. It usually wins. It, it just keeps pushing you. But we'll be able to use those wins in a while. To our advantage. What the hell? Can't go up. Oh, wait a second. I gotta use the cane. Yeah, I guess they don't want items to become obsolete very quickly. So you keep using them for other things. Panel. I think if we stomp on it hard enough, it might flip over. Yeah, we did that earlier. I don't. I don't think you noticed. I'm not gonna fall for this one. Every time I see a, a red rupee next to a bunch of green rupees, it has to be fake. There we go. We're doing good so far. just keep going up. There's no outer space here. <laughs> oh, what the hell? Ah! Too hard or too... or... or not fast enough is bad. Try that again. It almost looks like wing, uh, Link kind of grows wings. So he turns into Angel Link. <laughs> That'd be really nice though in a, in a Zelda game that Link can transform like an sort of an angel. 
and grow wings and fly around Hyrule. That'd be amazing. Whoa. Oh, these are on the way. Yeah, gotta break them first. That was so cruel. I had I was already here. Ah. <laughs> gotta wait till it's very close by. There we go. Let's go quickly. Pretty easy so far. Uh, one of these is supposed to be removable. And those birds, they're waiting. <laughs> they're like, oh, we're gonna get you. Wish I could just hit them from, from here, but they're too high. kind of like wings, but they're like more of a cape than wings. Oh, come on. That was a cheap shot. I'll get them now. Yeah, this temple's really fun. I really like this the design. And it's really no brainer. Okay. We have a uh I don't know how I could call that thing. A Swatcher? <laughs> Here we have another switch. Here. Here. And here. Yay! what's up here. Looks like a way out instead of a way in. Oh, great. Pushing putt puzzle. Oh, please, let me do this in one shot. I don't think too much ahead. I think, like, a few ahead and then I'm, like, Possibly screwing up. <clears throat> Let me get these out of the way just in case. Oh, I already screw it up. <laughs> Yeah, there's no way I can move that now. Great. Yeah, let's do that again. I think if I turn s s small again, it should reset. Oh, it didn't. Ugh. We need to zone out and zone in. Try that again. Ugh. Yeah, I really suck for these kinds of puzzles. That's why I say that if I play Portal, for example... Let's say if one day I get Portal... Um... I'm probably gonna do, like, a... Just for the lulls, a blind run. 
so that you guys can see me like fail miserably. <laughs> Wait a second. Um. Oh wait, 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 just push this. That's it. <laughs> yeah, I, I thought that I had to do a lot more than that. Yeah, that's how bad I am with puzzles. <laughs> so I think, I think a, a portal run, a portal blind run would be like really, really messy. Although it wouldn't be like completely blind because I I saw a gameplay. Uh, from the first one and the and the second one, but um, you know it was so long ago that I'm pretty sure it's not like I'm gonna remember everything that I saw. So I'm, you know, I, I highly doubt that I'll be like, oh, I remember this puzzle. Maybe the first ones, but you know, the first ones are gonna be easy, but later on, it's it's just gonna be a headache. Yeah. I think Link would still get his head cut with that thing. Even if he's like in that little hole. Uh. Let me try and push these guys out. <laughs> yeah. really nice to push them out and they can think about what they did as they fall through the uh, endless endless pit pit of doom wow this this is difficult here Gotta wait till the right time, cause they, the, those two. There comes some time when those two kind of. Uh, wow, are, are, are those are those two chickens having a debate right now? Jeez. They always pick the perfect time to do that. I heard ya. Uh, gotta get this guy before it electrifies. That's the good thing about it is that they come out and you can just uh... now this is how you use them for your benefit. <laughs> um. Oh, Nakitu, no! Please don't be mean. Be a good guy, like on. Mario 64, although I don't think anyone has not played, well, I can't say not anyone has not played Mario 64, because, or at least you've seen, like, footage of it or something, up until this point, like, in history, like, really? I'd say the average, uh, youngster these days at least have has seen uh, N64 Let's Plays or something out there. I mean, a lot of people have done Mario 64, but I guess you understand why I say that uh, Lakitu is a good guy in Super Mario 64. Oh, I can't get to that. Yeah, but on other uh, Mario games, he's like trying to kill Mario. I mean, I know that there are like a lot of them. You know, it's, it's, it's not like one Lucky Two, it's like a bunch of Lucky Twos, but you know. It's a messed up family. Some are evil and some are just really nice. <laughs> some are into the uh, television business. Broadcasting live how Mario might either succeed or die. Alright, so I guess I'm at a good stop. Uh, spot to stop because I'm at up to 20 minutes. And, uh. 
and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye-bye!